Hello, and welcome to a Saturday edition of Robert vs. the New York Times Crossword. It's currently 9.59pm on Friday, February 4th in New York City, meaning one minute into the Saturday crosswords. Taking a look at yesterday's leaderboard, we had me, followed by Aerotangos, the Glorp, and Herman Chow, 30 seconds around her. Pretty hard win today, we had Big Air, six letter fill going down. Then we had PB Geckner, KFS Venta, Kimball, Intaratuna, Rudwick, A plus B, Panaguchi, Gordo AM, and Hoopla under one minute. We had Stickers, Ruthann, Tonomad, Delu, J Wu, Lil Sun, J, ME17, and Ball Don't Lie. I was just bragging about these guys yesterday. J and Ball Don't Lie. <laughs> Had a rough follow up. Anyway, it's now 10 o'clock in New York City, meaning we should have some Saturday crosswords. So here is your spoiler alert for the Saturday Mini. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Mini is always free to play. Alright, let's do it. Uh, be honest with me, Roz here on Zoom. A dozen. Ooh. Floats. Temps. Docent. Opus. Pellets, I see. Just don't lie. Alright. Draft. Yeah, it took me a, a while. Doodle. On Zoom. Man. Like, two years ago. This would have made no sense. <laughs> In the New York Times crossword. But, it's a totally different world we live in now. Yeah, Chast Roz is one of the cartoonists to know a dozen. The other uh, actually doesn't bother me that much, because you do say a dozen all the time. Yeah, anyway, now for the main event, that's the Saturday Daily Grid, which is by Cameron Austin Collins today. Here's your spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Daily Grid does require a New York Times game subscription, and Cameron Austin Collins's construction philosophy, I think, is to sort of teach his readers things, or to not mind if it's stuff that I haven't heard of. <laughs> so I'm expecting this to be quite tricky, um, with some stuff that I'm just going to need the crosses for. So let's see what Cameron Austin Collins has in store for us. Let's get into it. Birdie. Broadway's Bye Bye Birdie. Old Time Messages. Over the bass or bed. Huh. Sea bass and sea bed, yeah. Colorful bird in the blackbird family. Crab, blank, nebula, palindromic periodic title, L, end of your office me memo, maybe raise, replete with, uh, I want an E here, okay, talk over, question mark, maze, patties, Up to the highest active volcano in the world, kind of grass, period, Maybe era. Love is so short for getting so long. And silent partner question mark. Is it deadly? Silent but deadly. Setting a classic Looney Tunes cartoon. Appointed by the court. Foot. Okay. Accept proposal. Okay. Throw on the floor. Area rug. That kind of throw. Marijuana, some say. Korean rice dish. Ah, oh, bibimbap. I do know this one. The right one can produce a smile. Cables. An Oreo. Mm. Army. Kelsey with? Or lousy with? What? Conrad here? Okay. Lousy with. I don't know that. Um like the villain's Max Shrek. Typical projects in this DIY. This is Say Yes. Crime Show Extras for short. I want this to be an, an S. Memory Measure, Bite. Humble. Blank Noir, Vet Noir. Certain pie filling. Archetypal bossy pants and result of selling out. Part of a quote. 
<clears throat> Hollywood precursor. Access Hollywood? What is this? Horn of Music. Lena Horn? Uh, I'm not going to know Bachelorette people. Like early uncensored Hollywood films. Now let's put this in speculatively. Disbands. This will be an S, right? Discussing buildups. Tears or tears. Majors, say. Um, this will be an S, too, I guess. It's a racket. River that flows through or beside ten countries. Is it Amazon? Rough blank anthem. There's no doubt about it. And sugar substitute. Question mark. Compound with a chemical twin is an isomer. I can row a boat. Um, I don't think this is Amazon anymore. This is Din. Danube? Non proliferate. This is end tests. Um, Rough Riders anthem. Staged. Lived on, live on water, say. Um, or live on water? Canoe, I see. There's no doubt about it. There's a sure bet. Cory Booker. Oh, I spelled this wrong. I must have. Um, Snookums? What is this, though? Staged. Oh, faked. Fast. Okay, that kind of living on water. <laughs> Russian writer and dis dissonant Limonov and Dome. Gets tight. Gets tight with. Okay. Um... What is this? Citing any classic Looney Tunes cartoon. Hmm. Pointed by the court. Marijuana, some say. Bronze producers. Um, blank Vecchio. Eponym of a lifetime achievement work. Fashion since 1984. Holiday pancake, maybe latka? Majors say. Like Kufrin, disgusting buildups. One way to put on a coat. Hollywood precursor and gets tight with. Bygone Vatican money. Do they use the lira? Sayings attribute to Jesus. Logos? Logia, I think, actually. I don't know how to end that with an A or an E. Oomph. So is it Pep? Dome. Oops. Not gonna help that much. Um, gets tight. Um, Alright. So you can see... We've got a lot of the the whole band going down the middle there. Not very much filled in, just the corners. Batman Returns. What could this possibly be? <laughs> mm. Right one can produce a smile. I want to... I feel like this is something to do with spray, spray on tans. Okay, it has something to do with tanning. It could be wrens, but it might not be. Is it cruds? Maybe. Result of selling out. Certain pie filling. Banana cream? I think that might be right. Ad litem or ex litem or something. Arepas. Putty tat, I see. Okay. Pablo Neruda and the Andes. Read? Crime show extras for short. Maybe perps? But how are they? Are they they're extras? Um, gateway drug, I see. Disbands. Ousts. Is it tased? 
humble lower ponte or something um something tyrant i don't know if that's right majors What is this? Can produce a smile. Parenthesis. Parenthesis, I see. It's tight with busts, maybe? Like a drug bust? I don't know what this is. Or this. Okay. Oh, packed house. Brass, I see. Like military brass. One way to put on a coat. Like early uncensored Hollywood films. Okay. This is a weird name. I don't think this is a B blank C blank something. All I'm saying is bacon, but it's not. It's not bacon. <laughs> So this could not be Pep, it could be Vim. What if I put Vim? I want an E there. I think I want an E there regardless. It's tight with... Bonds with? Hmm. I don't know which one I prefer here. One pin? Is that, is that a thing? I don't know what this is. Archetypal bossy pants. Something tight. Hmm. One way to put on a coat. Is this painting? Is it just painting, actually? It's tight. I don't think it's painting. This could be act, I guess. Hollywood precursor. I kind of like paint, though. Petty tyrant. Oh, maybe it's Becca? So maybe it is just a, um, part of a quote. Price, okay. Um, Planet Hollywood, okay. Tautens? No. Noggin. Paint gun. Okay. Um, Edward? What is this? Pre code and tenses gas. Alright, we made it through. We made it through, but this is, uh, I feel like this is classic Cameron Austin Collins, which is. Sort of lots of stuff I don't know, but just enough, just enough there to, to make my way through it with kind of a lot of difficulty. Um, yeah. So that's, uh, but maybe there wasn't as much stuff I didn't know. Pre-code. Yeah, so like, there's certainly stuff from worlds that I'm not at all familiar with, but 
let's uh let's take a look through this puzzle. I think generally there's lots of stuff to learn. Yeah. Bye bye birdie is not something that I have a lot of familiar familiar eh, familiarity with. I've maybe seen the film. At least parts of it. But I'm certainly not gonna remember names. To be fair, it is the, the title character, but yeah, so that's just not in my wheelhouse. Not like it's particularly hard. Um, Bye Bye Birdie is a big deal. Yeah. Random. Maybe it's not random, but <laughs> an Aruda quote. Yeah, so poetry also not a forte of mine, but again, I am a for I am strong in eating pibimp up. This is the second time in a couple months that we've had people up in the crossword, so that's nice. Silent but deadly. Lousy with, meaning replete with. Yeah. Her family has a large estate. They are lousy with money. The area is lousy with tourists. I, uh... I don't think I've ever used lousy this way. To me, lousy with money means you're bad with money, but... That's like a tricky... That's like a Saturday clue, I guess. Batman Returns. Max... I don't even know who Max Shrek is. So. <laughs> Ruthless business mogul. Yeah, so... I'm also not that super into superheroes, which perhaps Cameron Austin Collins is. I guess perps are extras because they change from week to week. Sea bass or sea bed? Sea bed. Yeah, this is like to humble somebody else. You would lower them. Should have really should have been able to get petty. Uh, Lena Horn. Logia. That's pretty hard. Proud I knew it. But I think I googled this last year. Otherwise, <laughs> I'm not sure I, I would have known it. Snickums. That's nice. Didn't know Edward Limonov. He died recently. Russian writer, poet, publicist, political dissident, and politician. There you go, Edward Limonov. Again, somebody who is certainly crossworthy. Certainly important, anyway, in the world, but not one that I know. Rough Rider's Anthem. The Crab Nebula? Let's look at some cool pictures of the Crab Nebula. I'm into that. Yeah. Here is mightily like a crab. Central stars and ejected gas. There you go. Uh... Tweety tat, yeah. Like, uh, I guess that's what Tweety Bird says. Ad litem is again out of my out of my area of expertise. That's yeah. I feel like grids are by Ca Ca Cameron Austin Collins are filled with stuff like this where you need the crosses, and that's just the way that it is. Um, I like this clue on parentheses a lot. The right one can produce a smile. Literally, the, the right closing parenthesis. That's that's a really nice clue. Spray on hands. Yeah, the, the middle section here is full with really nice stuff. The Ponte Vecchio. It's a, it's a bridge over the Arno in Florence. I actually have been to Florence. Look at that. There you go. Ponte Vecchio. Yeah. Was never gonna know this either. Bean Award. Jeffrey Bean Lifetime Achievement Award. That's uh squarely at my wheelhouse, but I'm sure some of you rejoiced at seeing that. Let me know. Yeah, this is like military brass. Yeah. Again, yeah, people who watch The Bachelor and the Bachelorette, I'm sure are excited to see this, but this name could have been anything. Just needed the crosses. Even when I had the B and the C. <laughs> I 
I was wondering if it was going to be some some name that I was, wouldn't recognize as a name. Cruds in the plural is a bit weird. Uh, yeah. Pre-code. Pre-code films. Pre-code Hollywood was the brief era of the American film industry between the widespread adoption of sound and pictures in 1929 and the enforcement of the Motion Picture Production Code censor Censorship Guideline, popularly known as the Hayes Code in mid-1934. So I think Cam Cameron Austin Collins is actually uh, like a film reviewer. So this is probably right up his alley, but I need the crosses basically. Yeah, Planet Hollywood. Access fits, but... End tests. So, can you be A tests or N tests? Lyra, Cory Booker, our mutual friend. Yep, so, you know, 1138 for a Cameron Austin Collins grid is, is not so bad for me, honestly. So, I'll certainly take it. I um, think the early week this week was super fast, so I was sort of expecting a, a slow, slow Saturday. Um, yeah, interesting. Learn some stuff. This will be pretty slow, but it's sort of what I expected even before we started. Um, leaderboard for tomorrow. We got nobody yet. I believe Stickers and Ogre are sort of busy in Seattle. Then we had Ruthann, Hoopla, and Sia Sophia. Nice to see you all on leaderboard on this Friday evening. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I will see you tomorrow for some Sunday puzzles. Although not at 6 p.m. I'll be watching the uh, the Duke UNC game. Go Duke. Anyway, see you then.